Peter, not your average guy on the never mind your own YouTube channel. I'm super excited because I have the Titan antenna system with me and I'm gonna try it out. And I'm in an area here, uh, it's a recreational area. It's a very open plain and then there's forest around it. It's not easy to find a location in the Netherlands where you can do long range flights quite well because the Netherlands is very flat and there's trees everywhere so it means very quickly you don't have a line of sight anymore and then you lose connection because the trees are in between or whatever so it's difficult to find a good spot but like here it's possible i can fly like six seven kilometers without getting in trouble like getting too close to an airfield or a road or whatever so good location to try it out and as you can maybe see in the background there's a car over here there are a lot of cars over here and there's continuously people passing by but the thing is with this antenna system i shoot theoretically be able to stay in the car and film myself like this without having people bothering me if i would stand outside people would constantly come and have a look to see what i'm doing i have all this equipment but now i can stay in the car so that's the goal to test whether that will work or not all right so the question is since this titan system you can choose whatever you want. What am I going to use? Am I going to use the booster? Am I going to use the whip antennas? And I'm, am I going to use the directional linear antenna? I think, let, let me think for a minute. I should use the directional antenna for sure because I'm just heading that way and coming back. So that's, that's one thing. Although I do want to test how far I can get with the whip antennas because with with default antennas you you can come like up to five five plus kilometers like what i did in cyprus so with these whip antennas you should be able to do six seven yeah probably but i'm in the car i'm quite low i'm flying out there so i might need a little bit of extra so i at least i should use the directional antennas let's do that without the booster and just see how far i can get and maybe i can even do another one with the booster if the range turns out not to be that much yep i'm gonna set up all right <laughs> this is so funny Okay, start recording this one. Start the propellers. Take off. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. Ah, <laughs> guys. Okay. I'm gonna fly in this, in this direction. I get a warning here. This is totally ridiculous because you can you can just safely fly here and i can see the screen so clearly that it's just beautiful it says i'm in a war that is just ridiculous i am not i am not well anyway i don't care what the thing says so there we are. It is at 2.4 gigahertz, which is good. I'm flying very low. 27, 30 meters, so I know I should fly higher to keep a good connection. But I will, I will slowly go up.
I got two bars. And I'm slowly uh, going higher. And I think I want to put the camera down a little bit more. Also, I don't know if the horizon is straight, but... Maybe like this. Okay. I want to fly up to 120 meters. Like this. Maximum flight altitude reached. And um I'm at two kilometers and I have one bar, which is not very much. So is there anything I could do about it? Like putting it a little bit like this and like this. I don't know. Because I do not know how far I will be able to get. Like this. Now it already lost signal because I was adjusting the antenna. Cancel. Turn around. It's very dark like this. I was flying into this direction. I only got, oh, now I got three bars all of a sudden. It is a little bit better. Occasionally I got two bars, so I'm just gonna Oh, because it, it already came back like 400 meters, because I, I, I remember I was at two. Okay, just, so let's, let's just see what the maximum is. Probably it is, it is about two. I won't be able to do a lot more than that. And that's it, it's two, one and a half, maybe two, two. Two, three. And it's gone. All right, now it will come back. Oh, it's still there. <laughs> it's still there, it didn't come at 
And um, what's possible, why I am not able to get that, I'm low to the ground, that's a disadvantage. I'm, I'm in and around the car, that may affect the signal. But also, I have long cables, so that is, um, it decreases the strength of the signal. So that may have an effect too. And that's why the booster may totally compensate that. Okay, so uh, at 2.5 I get the uh, signal back. What I'm going to do is I'm going to fly lower because I think that will be more beautiful. And I'm filming against the sun right now. Um, now I'm so low that the signal got lost. Maybe go up a little bit. Yeah, 60 meters. All right. Landing. The only thing is, I cannot catch it by hand like this, but I can visually land it like this. Perfect landing, no problems. Now I'm going to get another battery. Let's do the extra capacity battery. 